Hello Taurus, welcome to a quick bonus love reading. You were the most views out of the earth signs, so I'm doing this quick reading for you. This will be a general love reading, so it will not resonate with every Taurus watching. Spirit messages for Taurus regarding love. Let's see what we have for you, Taurus. For Taurus, messages regarding love. What does Taurus need to know, Spirit? Burning passion, passion, intimacy, chemistry. The chemistry is off the charts. Ooh, okay. Whatever this is, it's hot. <laughs> All right. What else? What else do you have for Taurus? Far apart, distance, separation, divide, distance. It's affecting the strength of this connection. Some sort of distance between you. I, I just heard a wall. Okay. Closed off. Yeah. Being closed off may blind you to the truth, quiet, shut out. There might not be a lot of communication with this person. At least not the kind of communication that you want to have, Taurus. So let's see. Spirit angels, guys. What messages do you have for Taurus? Regarding love. Messages for Taurus. Oh, I want to cut the deck. Hold on. Let's see what we have for you, Taurus. Six of Cups, Four of Wands, Reverse, Nine of Swords, Reverse. Okay, so something to do with the past here or past life connection, something very sweet, tender, a return as well, could be. Um, Six of Cups is all about coming home. Four of Wands, Reverse. This is somebody that's not in a happy situation, um, family issues, disconnect, discord, problems, conflict, etc. It's interrupting the balance and the harmony of something here. Nine of Swords Reverse is someone overcoming some sort of fear or anxiety that they have, seeing the light at the end of the tunnel, or perhaps they're not, they're kind of letting this get, like, take, take over this feeling of being fearful or anxious or stressed. So we'll see. Tell me about the Six of Cups. Why is the Six of Cups here? The Six of Cups here. Two of Swords Reverse. Why is the Six of Cups here? I just heard like a decision from the past. Okay. Let's see. Five. Yeah, this is something that happened in the past that you're still thinking about or is still affecting you now. Eight of Wands Reverse. Again, I don't feel like there's a lot of movement though or communication here. Just fear. Feeling stuck. Maybe someone doesn't know how to reach out. Maybe the distance is too great for them. Maybe you're scared of making the first move. Why is the Four of Wands reverse? Oof, Two of, two of Cups reverse. Definitely not a happy home. <laughs> this could be a breakup, a separation. Could be a separation with you or a separation that one of you is having outside of this connection. Tell me about the Four of Wands reverse. Taurus. The Magician Reverse. Mm. Seven of Wands Reverse. There's something not manifesting, not growing, a bad investment. This was a bad investment. Or the timing was off. Someone wasn't putting in enough effort or time into something and so it never really grew. Perhaps they were busy with something else or distracted by something else. Why is the Nine of Swords reverse? Oh my God, judgment reverse. So their judgment was wrong, was blocked or there was a judgment call, a, a decision blew up in someone's face. Yeah, it cost a tower. It costs an imbalance as well. There, there's something's off here, Taurus. For the Tauruses that I'm talking to, or the Taurians that I'm talking to, you know what I mean. There's something going, you know, there is a feeling of a disconnect. Even though there's a lot of attraction, even though there's a chemistry, a tie here, there's a disconnect. Someone is closed off or has kind of like screwed this up. That's really the nicest way that I can put it. Someone caused a tower and I feel like it's still affecting this connection now. I feel like this tower already happened 
And I feel like it's causing, this was a bad judgment call that someone made and it's still affecting this connection. Can you tell me about the tower? Whoa. Three of wands, seven of wands. Can you tell me about this tower? Why is the tower here? King of Pentacles. King of Pentacles for me as a reader is already in some sort of long-term commitment. Five of Cups, yeah. High Priestess. I feel like someone is secretly still not over what happened or still regretful, still thinking about how they screwed up here. They could be missing you, uh, Taurus, or just, you know, they messed something up here. And I feel like it had something to do with like opposition or like fighting back. Maybe there was a big fight. Tell me about death. Tell me about this King of Pentacles. Why is he here? Okay, so I feel like there, there was some definitely an ending here. I feel like, okay, you, hopefully you're not dealing with two different people. Because I have a King of Pentacles and King of Cups. I feel like this is more like emotional um, in someone's head right here. Fear. This King of Pentacles is scared trapped not moving not communicating hmm Give me one more for the six of cups i don't know if you if this was that you and this person had a happy home and this and someone screwed it up yeah someone got caught in the past doing something cherry at the bottom could be a cancer could be something to do with uh moving um long distance something like that coming to see someone someone got caught doing something they shouldn't have been doing it led to conflict to drama it led to possibly a separation something has not been able to manifest because of someone's screw up i'm going to pull some cards from my secret moon oracle deck here because i have some time tell me what happened here how is this person thinking or feeling about Taurus? This deck is not available yet, but I am working on it. How is this person thinking or feeling when it comes to Taurus or this connection spirit? You are my soulmate. I'm confused. Well, so am I. Tell me what's... It's all my fault. I made a mistake. Okay, yes. So th it, I feel like it was probably this person's fault, uh, whatever happened. But I feel like time has passed since then, Taurus. There is definitely Six of Cups, You Are My Soulmate. This is a soulmate type of connection or very strong connection. Um, I feel like this person might be confused because they're still thinking about this is what I'm getting. They don't understand why they're, they're still thinking about something that happened in the past or they don't understand why they, I feel, can't get you out of their head. I feel trapped right behind that. So I feel like, yes, this is trapped in fear. I'm ready to take action. Well, I hope so because you really need to fix this, I feel. Okay, so what is the potential outcome here for Taurus and this person? in the near future potential outcome please in the near future ace of coin reverse yikes okay ace of wands that's that burning passion three of swords reverse so there could be some sort of interference here um tower reverse three of cups reverse there's definitely an interference here possibly another partner or just someone involved around either on, on your side or on their side that's interfering in this connection could be distance could be money could be fear a third party interference is anything that could interfere in your connection 
Why is the Ace of Coin reverse? I feel like this person cannot offer you commitment possibly, or they can't make you this big offer. Two of Cups reverse. This could be a broken commitment. The Sun reverse. Seven of Cups reverse. I need to be careful because I feel like they are going to be possibly making a decision regarding the disconnect between you or regarding a commitment they're in. And I feel like this decision, it, it, it's almost like um, with the sun reverse, it's either made it is a secret decision or something that they're not expressing, like they're, they're hiding something here with the sun reverse. But with the seven of cups reverse, I don't know. It's almost like um, this could be that I'm confused. Eight of Wands, Ten of Cups, Six of Cups Reverse. Yeah, again, they have not been able to let the past go. They're stuck in the past. And I feel like they're confused because I feel like they, they're probably in a commitment or family situation at this time. So why are they thinking about the past? It's because they're still you're still connected to each other. Why is the Ace of Wands here? They might communicate with you with the Eight of Wands. And they're like expecting a message back or someone's waiting for a new beginning here. Justice reverse the wheel. Okay, you're going to need the wheel. So what I'm seeing here, to be honest, I'm seeing an interference still here that is preventing someone from committing to you completely. They might just communicate here. They're still confused. Um, and it's like they're waiting for a new passion to beginning with you, but it's like almost like they can only give you passion but they're still kind of closed off or unable to be all in. So be very careful because things might be off balance here with Justice Reverse. You get one more for Ace of Wands. Whoa. Eight of Swords Reverse. Well, okay. We get one more for the Ace of Wands. Ace of Cups. Wow. Yes. Okay. So I see love. I see passion. I see emotion but not commitment. I have the world reverse, so be very careful because I feel like this is uh, unfinished business. Someone needs to close this chapter completely. Not be in limbo. Yeah, they won't be able to invest again with the seven of coin reverse. So I feel like this is still ongoing, Taurus. If this is resonating for you, let me know down in the comments how it's resonating for you. I love to hear from you how the readings resonate, but I feel like this is still kind of like, someone needs to know exactly what they want and then make a decision, not be wishy-washy. I feel like that's what I'm getting here. Someone that's still kind of like unsure, might want to taste a little bit, but not really commit, you know? So be very careful, Taurus. All right, I'll leave this here. Hopefully this resonated. Hopefully you enjoyed this short reading. If you did, please hit the like button and subscribe. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you all in another video, hopefully. Take care.